uh, naltrexone has been studied, as most of you know. There are hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of studies on naltrexone for uh, narcotic addiction, for alcohol addiction, for various other things to try to understand how it works. And they definitely understand that they act as cytokines and they do affect every cell in the body. But uh, they didn't know really the mechanism. So it just wasn't studied in autistic kids. So um, you know all this, non-expensive, available orally. Anyway, because it was so bitter and because we use a lot of transdermal um, medicines in our children, I worked with Dr. Uh, Tyra Smith, who's a molecular pharmacologist at um, Coastal Compounding in Savannah, Georgia. And he created uh, for me a transdermal cream. Uh, he puts pure naltrexone powder without any filler into emu oil and it goes right in. It's extremely powerful, extremely effective. And parents have shown over and over going from one line, which is six tenths of a milligram to one milligram, the child will make a lot of difference. Anyway, this was very effective and because Dr. Bihari's uh, experiments had shown that the um, endorphins are kicked out and uh, according to the, um, the circadian rhythm and it's best to take it at night, uh, the parents will rub it on the children's bodies when they go to bed, not when the children go to bed because the kids are usually asleep by 11 o'clock, hopefully, and uh, the parents will rub it on the, the kids right before they go to bed.